Moving Evidence Between Students in Portfolio. Hello friends, today I'm going to show you how to take evidence out of a child's portfolio if you've accidentally uploaded it to the wrong student's portfolio. I'm going to go here into my portfolio. I'll select the student. So let's say I put something here under Edna Krabappel and I look and I go, oh my goodness, I put the ongoing writing sample of Bart Simpson in Edna Krabappel's portfolio by mistake using the portfolio app. I wasn't paying attention. I was working too fast. I was trying to multitask and whoops. So what I'm going to do is I'm actually going to download this to my computer. So right now I'm on a Chromebook or I'm on a PC, whatever I'm working from. This is not on my phone. This is not on a mobile device. Device, uh, such as a phone or a tablet. So this can only be done from the web-based um, Brightspace. So what I'm going to do is I, I clicked on that three dots on the top and I click on the word download. Now that I see this evidence, I say, yes, it's Bart Simpson. It shouldn't be in here in Edna Krabappel's. I'm going to right click or if I'm on a Chromebook, I'm doing a two finger click. So click on the trackpad with two fingers or if you're using a mouse, you're using the right mouse button. And up will pop a little thing here. We're going to say save image as. So I'm going to say Bart Simpson writing sample. And then that can save if I'm on a computer, it goes to my desktop or I can save it to my downloads folder on my Chromebook. So now that I've done that, I can go back. Here I am. And now I can actually, uh, I can delete the evidence if I want, or I can just unapprove the evidence. If I'm at all worried that that didn't somehow save to my Chromebook or my computer, I can just unapprove it for now so that it no longer appears in his current, in her current, current portfolio. So now when I look at Edna Krabappel's portfolio, I don't see that Bart Simpson piece. So now what I want to do is I want to go into Bart Simpson. So I'm going to go back to class list, go to Bart Simpson and add to portfolio. So this is where I can drag and drop. I'm not going to my Google Drive because I didn't save it to my Google Drive. So I'm going to browse and I'm going to click Bart Simpson, double click on the writing sample. If you're on a Chromebook, it'll be found in your downloads folder. There we go. Evidence has now been uploaded successfully. It saved it as Bart Simpson writing sample. So now when I go back, I see that it's in Bart Simpson's portfolio and I can double check and make sure it's no longer in Edna Krabappel.